Well, hello, everybody. My name is Jason McDonald, of course. I have had a lot of questions about how to submit news, how to put news up on the Internet. So I thought I'd do a quick video on news release syndication, talk about why Google likes news, why news is such a great uh, free SEO opportunity. So let's get started. Uh, before we do, I've also had questions about the video quality. So I wanted to explain you want to reset the YouTube video resolution to HD and you want to maximize the screen. So I have a little picture here of the bottom there. Right at the bottom right of your YouTube video, you're going to see that. So first, change your screen resolution to high definition by opening that little box, selecting uh, HD 720. And second, you can maximize the screen and that way you can really see uh, everything that we're doing in our videos. So let's talk a little bit about why Google loves news, fresh content news, all that jazz. So first of all, real-time search, Google has it, Bing has it. Everybody's chasing the latest news story. So the more you generate new content, the better you're going to do in your SEO performance, your Google rank. Secondly, Google gives priority to sites that update frequently. So the more you update, the better your reputation becomes. So news and news releases are really the number one free opportunity for creating what I would call freshness, the freshness factor on Google. So let's just take a peek at how Google rewards fresh content. Uh, okay, so let me see here. So first I have, I have a couple um, searches built out. So here's a search for the limited 2011 IRS amnesty. And let's take a look at that search and see what we have. So here we have our Google search. And notice here we have a newspaper, SF Gate. And what's really interesting is look at this guy right here in page one, position three or four. Now let's check that guy out. And what is that? Let's open that up. That is a news release by Tax Resolution Services on Pitch Engine from way back in February, believe it or not, still showing up on page one, position four. Here's another release, press release point. PRLog.org. So lots of free news releases are getting to the top of Google by uh, being submitted. So you want to look at that. Here's another example. Credit card debt. Let's open this guy up. Everybody's in debt these days. I feel like Susie Orman when I do these videos. Here's credit card debt. Let's go down. This is another very common thing that you see on, news, on, video, on uh, Google. So you see the news being run, getting a lot of preeminence. So you'll see news, and sometimes you'll actually see news releases down here and not articles on the major services. So news gets to the top of Google. It's clearly prioritized as uh, one of the issues uh, in the search uh, algorithm. Okay, so now news releases are very easy to do. I'm not going to spend a lot of time. These are very short videos, but you want to post to your own website, you want to post SEO friendly HTML news releases and you want to feature those on your home page. Our website, jm-seo.org, you can look at how we do news. It's sort of a model for our students taking our classes on how to put news up there. Now let's talk about syndication. There are services such as pitchengine.com, prlog.org, freepressrelease.com. There is a bunch of these services that will syndicate for free. I'm going to look at my favorite, which is Pitch Engine, and I'm going to show you how to syndicate a news release. So let's look at how we're going to do this. We're going to do this together uh, for the first time. So over here on Pitch Engine, I'm going to log into my Pitch Engine account, and I'm going to show you how to syndicate a news release. So first of all, you do have to sign up for a free account. Uh, I actually have a paid account, but for free, they will let you run one news release at a time for free. So for absolutely free, they will run it for you. Now, I'm going to go over to our website, and I'm going to log in. I'm going to go to our news release. So the first thing I do is post that news release on my website. So it's posted here. It's ready to rock and roll. I'm going to copy the headline. I'm going to go over to Pitch Engine, and I've actually got one started, but let's just start all uh, from the beginning. I'm going to see all news releases. I'm going to click news release. I'm going to paste the headline in. Really simple. Then I'm going to take what I call the kicker. I'm going to copy that kicker. I'm going to paste that kicker here. Then I'm going to get all of my text. I'm going to get that text all the way to the bottom. Control C as in Charlie. I'm going to paste that in here. So for absolutely free, you can do one news release at a time. 
I'm going to clean this up just a little bit. I'm going to get rid of the date because they'll put that date in there automatically. Here's a trick. Now you want at least one link to somewhere in your website uh, running. Now you have to know a little HTML. So I'm going to copy that. I'm going to write my HTML ahref equals quote. And I'm going to put that in there. So I have my ahref, my news release URL, my close A. So that's going to become an active link. And at the bottom where I have my own website, our corporate website, same thing. I'm going to make that an active link. So those are now going to be active links. My Twitter pitch. So I'm going to get my Twitter pitch. I'm lazy. I do it all on my own website first. I'm going to go view, page source. I'm going to grab my meta description tag, control C. I'm going to go back into my pitch engine paste that in there. It's going to truncate it sometimes. My keywords here I'm going after SEO training, SEO training classes. News facts, I can put something in here like amazing SEO training classes online. Things that will be highlighted. And here's a new, real cool one, resource link. So let's take uh, something that we want to show up on. This is our class pass for our training. I'm going to copy that URL. I'm going to put that in here. I'm going to put add links. So I'm going to put a keyword that I want to show in, show up on. So I'm going to put SEO classes online. That's one of our keywords that we target. Control V, add, uh, close. Tags. Here's where I'm going to put in tags that people will pull this news from. So I'm going to put in SEO, search engine, optimization, Google, uh, SEM, search, and I'm going to put classes, training, uh, seminars, free webinars. So I'm going to put sort of things that people might be pulling from uh, the search uh, feed, the feed from Pitch Engine. So I've got that all set. I'm going to hit save. I'm going to click preview. I'm going to see I have a nice title, a nice keyword that I want to dominate, SEO training classes, blah, 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 blah. I have a nice link in it. I have an active link for my company. I have a Twitter pitch. I have a news fix, news facts. I have resource links. I have tags. I'm ready to go. I'm going to close out of preview mode. I'm going to click live. I'm going to go back to my list. So now it's live. I'm going to go back to the list. I'm going to right click and open that up. I'm going to see it live on the internet. So there we go. We've posted it to Pitch Engine. Now why is this valuable? Let's go back and see one more thing before we're done here. Let's go to a re release we did a while back, free reputation management tool on our Buzz tool. So I'm going to copy some of the headline there, control C. I'm going to go over to Internet Explorer. I'm going to type quote, quote. And I'm going to show you there's about 5,500 websites that ran that news release for free. Absolutely zero cost to me. 5,500 websites. Let's do a search that we're targeting, free reputation management tool. Hit enter. You can see here are some of our news releases. This is PR Web. It was another one we ran. And somewhere on this page, page one. This is a very new tool for us. So we're on page one for a pretty good search for us. Partially how we did that is running news releases. So news releases, fantastic opportunity. Get them up there. Use a service like PitchEngine.com for absolutely free. You can use them to leverage. Get up there. Get yourself some freshness. It's pretty amazing. So if you have any questions, I'm always happy to take student questions. I've got my email and my phone number there on the screen. So give me a call or shoot me an email. Thanks so much for watching.